Nice. Ah, no, let's, let's get drunk, Ray. <laughs> uh. Wait, what? What is this happening? Is this real life? Yes. This is definitely oh, not. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, this is happening. Hi, Muno. Uh, joining Salty Fun on the mic. Um, and we have Fox versus Greninja. And if I commentated the last time that these two played, it was indeed this matchup. Devin, I'm sure you recall uh, Level 9 Fox. Good Ooh, night. Uh, oh, an attack! All right, I'm actually surprised. That is not untackable. That is one of the strongest counters in the game. So, death, suffering. Good night. Now, what are the, what, why would he pick Fox in this matchup? Because it feels already we're seeing that the offstage is just so hard against Greninja. No, I think it's a similar philosophy to Smash 4, where Fox definitely did really well versus Greninja. And that was mainly because um, Greninja does not have great out of shield, as we already know. Has a really good jump, but outside of that, uh, the out of shield is fairly weak from Greninja. Fox, a character, can be plus, uh, not quite plus, but almost plus, quite a lot of the time. So you're going to see uh, Venia uh, trying to abuse that, forcing Venia into a situation where he has to block, being plus, and then mixing him afterward. A little bit of set play going to come out from uh, Jen in all likelihood. But Venia in general doesn't shield that much. He stays no, very that's mobile. True. To, the, but, to, to the point where I'm wondering how he's going to catch him effectively. Like you see these full hops and he's going for these mm -hmm. up airs and neutral airs, but they haven't really been intercepting Venia when he's in the air. Yeah, that, and that's the thing. Fox, as, as well as having... Um, Ooh, multi-hit. Unfortunate. Try to up smash on the parry. However, Fox does have really good anti-airs. Up air, up smash. Uh, up smash especially being completely intangible uh, on the foot and the head. Uh, which makes it really difficult for Greninja to get back to the state or get back to the floor if landing on top of Fox. Which uh, Greninja, obviously with Nair and with forward air, is going to be spacing in that range where he's going to be in range of Fox up smash. Then uh, definitely could have gotten the kill right there. I feel like, and I really understand why he would be going through a little yeah. bit safer, but just because you're ahead doesn't mean that you want to take it easy mm -hmm. on the opponent. That just end their stock, get a three stock to one lead. That Ooh. way, your any fears you have can completely alleviate it. Nice tech oh, by Benia. Oh, when he counters, stop, that's yeah. gonna be it. And smartly does not go down as the bottom blast zone on this stage is one of the smallest in the game. What would have been able to get back on most other stages if had he had done that? However, goes up, knows he's gonna see the stock, one of the strongest towers in the game, as previously mentioned. And that is going to be a two-stock lead for Venia. Uh, and you notice now, the, this is so cool. Jen is starting to be more aggressive with his moves, and Venia is just counteracting it by just fading back just a little bit. We've seen a bunch of dares just whip and get punished. Mm -hmm. So at this point, do you think we're going to see a character switch? I game would like to say yes. Uh, it wouldn't shock me if Jen, knowing his personality, at least stays Fox for a little bit. Nice snare deep, uh, edge guard by Fox. Not often we see that. Um, however, working out for Jen, now back in disadvantage. Looking for a two frame right there is Venia just barely misses it. Back air on the illusion, just short. Oh, Funny. Just not really big. Looking for a landing. I would have liked to have seen a dash out there. Um, or, or like a pivot at up tilt. Yeah, something along those lines. But so yeah, definitely a um when you're a down this, Yeah. You have to go for yeah. max, maximize damage rather than safety here. Uh, that that grab is I am up up a stock grab. So I just want to get the guaranteed. Uh, there's some some risk. Management coming out here. Difficult as Fox for sure. He did the play such a fast pace against Greninja at back air. Gonna be enough. Is there a jump? There is no jump. Oh, there is. That was. Uh, uh, I like the idea. A little too low. Um, even Fox. Uh, Fox was an incredible recovery um, comparatively to uh, Smash 4, I would say. And uh, yeah, so unfortunately, a little too deep. Uh, if I'm a betting man, we're gonna go right back. Unless he lets him go Battlefield. Which. Does Alan, otherwise known as Jen, go battlefield? Uh, yeah, he is sticking with it, and I think that we are still on. PS2? I think I think we're still on PS2, if I remember seeing correctly. Yeah. yeah. All right. Um, just a straight run back, which I mean, that's kind of in Jen's personality. Yeah. But do you think he actually learned what he needs to, or does have it just not be a total repeat? So, if there was one thing that I remember from the Jen versus Venya set, is that Venya did indeed win game one against Fox, and then Jen continued to go Fox after Fox ends up the 2-0 uh, immediately afterward. Uh, no jump. Uh, disadvantage for Fox. Difficult to get back, but you have your jump back now. Never mind. Go to side B straight to the ledge. 
Um, unfortunate. Uh, Jen, the research management there could have been a tiny bit better, I think, in disadvantage. It's definitely super tough, though. Against Greninja, this character has an absurd oh, advantage stage. No. Okay, great, yeah. great tech. If, if you're going to be going against Venia nearly every week at Xeno or Xeno Saga this time around, uh, yeah, you're going to have to know how to take those multi-hits. And it, as difficult as it is, uh, the muscle memory needs to be there. And Jen's got it. Oh, looking for an air as well. Not true combo just yet for Venia. Oh, he has no top. Mm, down air. Wow. Ooh, that's that's tough. Because uh, that move doesn't have nearly as much lag as it looks as it should, being how much it has in Smash 4 upon landing. So it's still tough for Fox, even as fast as he is to get it there and punish that. Nice bang goal by Jen. Ooh, Nair's not going to send a tumble just yet. That one is looking for the chase, and Venny doesn't actually pass the deck. Nice reflector, just being able to put, alleviate some of that pressure while he's off stage. But up throw. Oh. That's enough. Yeah, and now Venia, this is very similar to game one. It just feels like he's in complete control. This is actually even more one sided this time around. Three stocks to one, and honestly, a pretty healthy third stock, all mm -hmm. things considered. Like, Fox is a character that obviously can kill early, but when you're in neutral like this, especially when you're trying to play neutral and not get hit by an errant anything, yeah. it's so hard to actually get the kill right there. He got too hungry, Ooh. and again, he goes to these forward up smashes. Obviously, he needs to uh. go for that if he wants to win the game, but nonetheless, he's... Yeah, it's, these are desperation options out, out right now. Again, you, Jet needs it. He has to kind of have... The mentality of, I need to take as much risk as possible here, otherwise I am going to get absolutely not enough reward to bring this game back. Oh. I like the idea. Unfortunately, Benny is actually going to get the second, and he's going to get a follow-up off of this. That's two up airs. That was a whole lot of damage. Back air still not enough, despite Greninja's fairly late weight. And that is his stock back and finally enough for Jen. Uh, gonna have to maintain face control as best as possible. Doesn't have to yield the invincibility now. Nice up air should be two. No, misses out. It's barely not true. That's, that's gonna be a third. No, reset. I was starting to see, starting to see the pieces come together for Jen a little bit. But considering the fact that his margin for error right now is high, teeny weeny. Yeah. Uh, Here's the thing. So now that Venia is going to be playing a little bit safer, he's going to be blocking a little bit more, and we've seen it already. The set play is starting. Jen is uh, nairing Venia's shield, and Venia is being forced to guess. Uh, it's super difficult uh, once Fox hits your block. Uh, it's only minus three or four. It is tough to get out of that situation, especially when Fox has a frame two jab, frame two jab. I don't remember exactly. He's got a two or three. Ooh, he just barely oh. missed that punish. Jen on the air. Because he was facing the other way. Yeah. He couldn't get the, uh, I thought he, he he definitely thought his dash would have gone a little bit farther. That's going to be a stock, though. And if Jen plays as immaculately as he did that last uh, ooh, that last stock, he may very well be able to bring his back. He needs to play more immaculately yeah. because he cannot get touched at all. Uh, Jen, oh, Venia waited for the air dodge to jump as he up aired. He's been air dodging quite a bit and been getting away with it. Not an air, not positive on block just yet. That should be it. Yep, up throw. Yeah, that's going to be a stock. And that is going to be game two in the favor of Venia. Of course, we are best of five in this top eight, as we just saw. But things are progressively getting better for Jen. But I'm wondering whether the rate is enough for him to be comfortable going Fox again. Yeah, he's just... The fact that he's insta-picking back there, I think he's going to be staying with that Fox. He's going to be getting a game three. And, yeah, Jen is that type of player. Uh, we, know, we knew this all too well already. Jen is the type of player that uh, he's going to make something work regardless of what the result has been in the past two games. And that game three, all things considered, wasn't as unclose as it could have been. I probably will. Um, oh, up air. Looking for a recent out. Jen actually doing a phenomenal job in advantage. If Greninja does have a flaw, then he does have a little bit of trouble getting back to the floor. Even though he's a fast fall, which sometimes can be difficult to juggle, he actually does not have a whole lot of options outside of air dodge just to get back down to the ground when you are disadvantaged, but neither does Fox. And as we all know, Venia has been doing an excellent job of keeping Venia or, or this Fox of Jen's either in the air or off the stage. 
beautiful placement on that Firefox. Just at a very awkward place for uh, Benny to Nice, really there you go. It. And now, finally, after two sets of being behind the entire time, pretty much, Jen has a lead. And, th and that's kind of the, I think, the reactions are there now. Where I feel like in the first two games, it was pretty clear that Jen's reactions weren't as ideal as he would like them to be. And then you saw towards the end of that game number two, uh, reactions started getting better, punching out a shield. Because while Greenish is fairly safe on shield, not completely safe. Has also the, are, are not by any means. Um, plus on block. Like the bear that we saw. I think early in the set, Jen maybe would not have punished that nearly as hard. Maybe would have just gotten a grab. But his reaction there was beautiful. That's what he stopped. Um, reaction there was beautiful. And Jen uh, been really good now since that last uh, game uh, two interaction. Ooh, that's safe, baby. Nice. Looking for a follow-up afterward. Oh, uh, Fox with an air. Oh, that is jump. Great jump by Jen. Can't go up to say Dox because you are Fox. However, looking for an air confirmed. Uh, but now, Venia, or rather Jen, in disadvantage. It's back. Back air. Just fight. Uh, uh, okay. Nice. Yeah, I, the reactions right. are there now. Where I feel like he wasn't punishing Venia before. He knows that Venia is mashing near, after nearly every single time that he hits his block. Either that, or he's jumping. So, uh, the response to that is, hey, you're jumping and or you're mashing. Here's my invincible foot and head that will beat both of them. Uh, in my Fox up smash out of shield. Back air, not enough. Fox just light enough, and that is a stale back air. Wow. wow! The angle, and he has no ledge invincibility. Great capitalization. He actually beats out the Shadow Sneak. A risky take, but really works out for Jen. He's already managed to do 47, yeah, 53%, this is very... and this combo's getting bigger and bigger. No jump, though. And he's back. Wow. Got back to the ledge after Venia did. Gonna be able to get the trump. Looking for some more safe on the block options, as I'm sure Venia is. Looking for Nair on the jump up. Venia finally no longer giving him that uh, non-defensive option. Finally goes for the spot dodge after the uh, poke on block. Up throw should be enough. Forward throw to send him off stage once more. That is going to kill us pretty darn soon. Nice air dodge. Beautiful. Finally even things up. We're on the last stock here. Venia only needs one. He, he, he can definitely take this back, and if he does, that's it. He gets to move on, and I think that's going to be really important. Yeah, and we, we, we know what Jen's This box is for. getting better and better, more well adapted to the way he's playing. If this goes to a game four, goes to a game five, and it, I, I honestly feel like the way that Jen is playing now, that's he reaction. could take right. the set. That's what I'm saying. The reactions are there now where they weren't before. You saw the tech chases, the air dodges, hasn't even missing those just barely. So it's it's not just the reactions. The reactions, I would say, were there, now that I think about it. But it's it's the spacing on said reactions that were a little bit off. We saw him missing air dodge punishes, whiffing up smashes, and now he's getting those. I can't think of the last up smash he actually whiffed. I don't think actually, he's going to be back to PS2. Did you see? I did not. Well, we'll probably but it, a... it would not shock me if any of went to PS2. But I, saw, I heard moving of the cursor during the screen. We're going to find out, and we're back right, anyway. It is back to PS2. Um, I don't know how to feel about that, just because if you look at the trend of how things have been going, Jen is getting a better handle, and maybe just changing the stage will, at the very least, shift yep. up his momentum, you know? If he's taking steps forward, yep. steps forward, steps forward, you know, having a different stage, different platform layouts, yeah. he might make it, you know, he'll, he might misstep enough that uh, he can just take a... Oh, God. Uh, at the very least, throw off his momentum, for sure. Um, kind of make it, force him to move a little bit differently on a stage. Like, I don't know if you'd want to take Fox to the battlefield, necessarily. But, um, on a stage, you know, like a uh, Genova or a Cowl, so you have a different platform layout. That's going to be a big deal, you know, kind of forcing Fox to move in a different way. Uh, you know, I understand that maybe both these players, they believe that this is fairly even for both, and they don't mind going back to it every single time. But, eh, Jenna has gained pretty much complete momentum. Oh, wow. they called out. Actually, they called out. that was the sort of thing, like, that neutral air, I don't think Benny was expecting to yeah. be met with that up smash. He's both. Oh, no. Oh, no. Luna's here, folks. You guys don't know. Um, Luna is here. But, yeah. However, uh, ooh, beautiful powering by um, Venia. Snow's obviously Nair going to be a hitbox that is going to be lingering. Fairly easy to um, parry in comparison to many other aerials. Um, ooh, look at that scoop up. Yeah, I think that parrying is going to be huge. Yeah. Matchup. Greninja in general is a 
and it kind of falls victim to good parrying because a lot of his normal moves that he loves to be spacing right. like neutral air and forward air kind of telegraph if you're very yeah. careful and carrying them makes them no longer safe. Right. So they, I, pretty much outside of back air, very difficult to, um, or, or rather, on the easier side to... Oh, God, you're dead? Okay, all right. I definitely Jeez. thought he might have died. Um, down throw? Next that was up. such a call out. This is, uh... He's okay. not dead yet right. either, but this might be the sort of thing where Jen is getting a maybe scared mm. because he's starting to shield a little bit more, especially when Benny is chasing him down. Which, yeah, he's going through grabs. I like the idea of shine there, but Benny waiting for it, waiting for the defensive option. Jen gives it to him. The DI out. Oh, and Firefox on the stage works out for Jen. Looking back center stage, fair is going to be enough. Benny and Al holds space. The up smash that was brilliant. Uh, that's that's work. a desperation up smash. I don't think you have to be quite desperate yet. Uh, uh, yeah, that's uh, it's, it's a mix up. I like the idea. I mean, he's definitely jumping out of the situation a lot. Jen notices that, but holds shield probably the first time the entire set does Benny there. Ah, uh, fair. Now you gotta get a little bit desperate. Forty percent, well, not a whole lot for Fox. Uh, getting him to that point where you could start comboing him is a little bit difficult. Yeah, 55 is a deficit. Yeah, this is the deficit now. 80% this is a bad deficit. Now yeah, you're, now you're stage. in. I don't know if he has a jump. Oh, I the side side that was insane. Yeah. Okay, and up on the landing. Jen in this game, uh, again, gonna have to play as he did in that game two at the very end of it, in this game three that he had. Game four, looking potential. Oh, air dodge. There's so uh, many things spaghetti. he just can't mess spaghetti. up. Uh, he goes to meet him, but the up air does not actually hit. This is possibly, this dash attack might be the big uh, start, but the up, is not. yeah, he's gonna die off the top there. We actually see a controller disconnect. That is Venia yeah. winning that set, and he's gonna be moving on in yeah. the winners, right? That yeah, that's, that's what it said. Yeah. So that's, that's him going on to winners finals. And, does uh, that mean that winners finals is gonna be numbers versus Venia? Is it? I thought, no, numbers is and losers for sure. 100%. Really? Numbers lost to Frozen. No, numbers lost to Jen, my bad. Uh,